Welcome to Utopia's Vignettes, a video series about MDG. Today we're going to talk about enhancing your drop-down lists. In ECC today you have legacy drop-down lists and by that I mean there's values in the list that you no longer use going forward but you have to keep behind for purposes of history. So I'm going to show you how in MDG we can restrict those lists to only show the active items and then to minimize those choices for the user even further. Here we are in SAP ECC and I've selected the drop-down list for object type. You can see there's 313 entries in this list. Most of these we no longer use, however we have to keep them around for historical purposes. We only want to use the existing 120 records that begin with U underscore. Let me show you in MDG how we can restrict this list to only show you those values. Here I am inside that same record inside MDG and you can see that the technical object type field drop-down list is now restricted to only the 120 allowable values. I can further restrict this list by selecting the equipment category. Here I have rules set up that says if I change this to an instrument, the technical object type list will only show the instrument values that I'm allowing, in this case five of them. If I change this to equipment category R for rotating equipment, the list again changes to only show me the rotating equipment drop-down lists that are allowed. In this case I can pick U underscore Poos for a centrifugal pump, and now I've corrected the record. Thank you so much for watching our vignette today. Go to utopiainc.com for more information or to watch more in the series of vignettes that we have. Remember to make yourself an amazing day.